Providing healthy options for students has set a trend at the Cass Lake Bina Middle School. Our Josh Peterson found that changes in the students' daily routines have made improvements in their everyday lives. The Cass Lake Bina schools are taking on a statewide issue and are leading the way when it comes to making healthy choices. Thanks to a test program issued by the Center of Prevention at Blue Cross and Blue Shield of Minnesota, the program not only engages students in making healthy choices, but to get out and be active. What the pilot project was doing was trying to make a connection to see if physical and active students and healthy students actually impacted student achievement. Over the past few years, the program has evolved the school's culture, and staff has already seen dramatic improvements in students' behavioral patterns. We've seen a positive experience, I think, in behavior. Um, our kids actually love being outdoors, um, especially at our middle Middle school. A key component of middle school success is active recess. Most Minnesota middle schools do not have recess, but the positive results are hard to argue with. For part of the student's lunch period, kids get a chance to play in a variety of organized games or be adventurous on their new outdoor playground. We've noticed that probably at least 90% of our students are active on any given day. So the activity of our kids during this recess time has been phenomenal and definitely increased. After seeing an overwhelming success in the active recess program, the school district transformed what used to be a staff parking lot into a recreational area for all middle school students. We've moved um, our recess out to the back side of the school. So with the new playground and the new um, safe area in the back, um, it, it's just so much better. Even after the program ends in 2017, because of the dramatic improvement in the school's everyday culture, the school has found ways to sustain the program. In Cass Lake, I'm Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. Now this is the last year the school will be part of the study conducted by Blue Cross and Blue Shield of Minnesota, but the school plans to continue with the successful elements of the program for years to come. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.